Because uh, what what uh, I think what got me to uh, like that that just revealed it for me is it had the Russian the you know the red star. Yeah, I, I know what you mean. And everything was Russian World in that premiere. game. That's really cool looking. Another. Ooh, captured in 4K. We I wish we had a 4K TV. I would love to see this in 4K. What is this? The first to see the gods. The first to tame their beasts. The first to guard the soul from evil. We conquered this land and built an empire. It's a lot of action games, but I feel. Are whispers on the wind. Well, yeah, because action games a are fucking awesome. Is this Assassin's Creed? No way. Dude, why are they doing Assassin's Creed Egypt? I want to see Assassin's Creed Samurai Edo area. <laughs> yeah, era. I did too. I want to see fucking they Samurai Ezio running up, fucking shanking people with a katana, or somebody or in, in that line, or something, something in that t family tree line. Instead, we're getting Egyptians and gladiators. The fuck? That hood gave it away. That's for sure. Cause that hood is pretty iconic now. You know. Now, I don't know how to feel about this. The Brotherhood begins. Whoa! You know what? Assassin's Creed Origins. Fuck. It's a prequel. True prequel. Alright, so if it's from ancient Egypt, then we may not get something from the Edo period. Because wasn't Edo period before Egyptians? Thank you. Yeah. Uh... No. Ancient Egypt is no. the birthplace uh, of modern civilization. It's more uh, later. And it is also okay. It's during the time when guns the started coming through. Yeah, with the invention of yeah, the pattern. Origins yeah. Is taking you to the You're perfect right. setting for an epic I will say this adventure. though. Egypt, what if the Assassin's Creed series, the reason why they picked Egypt, the is because fingers. of the gods? What Assassin's if there's like origins gods in these? Like, or, the like mythical Maybe monsters? Maybe this will explain more about the Apple of Eden. Bayek and go ahead and like show its Medjai, exact origin or what led up to its creation or something. Yeah. The Egyptian sheriff, this might be pretty cool to see. So and there's possibilities with it. Against the dark forces that corrupt ancient Egypt will lead to the foundation of the Assassin's Brotherhood. But recreating ancient Egypt, going back so far in time, pushed us to rethink and expand our gameplay mechanics. We added many RPG elements to a huge systemic world, more detailed and alive than ever before. So today, we are very proud to show you what the game looks like on Xbox One X running in 4K. And now, just for you, Bayek is coming back to Siwa, his hometown, to kill the fake oracle, Medunamun. World premiere. Dude, this is just straight up world premieres. Just That's one cool, after though. the other. That's cool though. I mean I'm not saying that it's a bad thing. It's cool. Ubisoft. Uh, Ubisoft. Yeah. yeah, but Assassin's Creed is Ubisoft too, so. I understand. I just hope that they don't go overboard with the fucking DLCs like they did. Yeah. Ubisoft has a bad track record lately. Oh, just me, guys. Like, I was, I was just like a hard one for a transition. That's fine. That's fine. So, uh, well, like we were saying, Ubisoft has a bad track record right now. They need to come back and they need to do more free stuff at this point. And they need to make sure that the multiplayer is not broken on arrival. Yeah, and if EA can do it, they can do it. EA has fixed everything they had problems with. Yeah, but Ubisoft's had a, a bad track record. Yeah. They're just now starting to fix so it up. Did, so did EA, but they came back. They're, they're okay now. Yeah, it's like, I am apprehensive, but looking forward to it. Mm-hmm. 
that's where I lie on this right now. Now, dude, that looks like a Metal Gear Solid fucking five map. Yeah, the one where you have to go up and infiltrate the camps. <laughs> um, I will say this though. What's up? Um, about this Assassin's dude, you Creed. Could scout with an eagle or a falcon. That's pretty cool. Resembles a fortress. I want to say this though. What happened? I'm I'm pretty iffy about this Assassin's Creed just because lately it's. It's just another uh, game, in my opinion. Like, game series. Yeah. I heard Syndicate was really good, though. Syndicate was supposed to be very good. And, and it was really good, from what I heard. Yeah, block. same here. But it does, that's one block, game that's not going to fix everything, either. Because sure. Black Flag is an amazing game, too, but it's not going to be like anything that can beat other games in that category. Well, definitely. Yeah. So, I don't know where this game... It's really at a weird place right now. Especially since they had a movie that flopped, by the way. Yeah. It's like, Fastbender is a great actor, but it's like... Wrong team. Wrong yeah. movie. Wrong. So we got I'm every... just waiting for the point where somebody makes a misstep <gasps> and jumps into no... Oh my god, that was badass. That was pretty cool. Eagle Eye. That was cool. Not enough to save that me. Reflex, that reflex-esque mode. Be here. So, the one thing I will say about Xbox One X, this is a good time to actually put out 4K because every TV now is 4K. Even lower end TVs are around the $400 range are 4K now. Yeah, you have a point there. You can get an Insignia TV that's only $300. That's 4K. Yeah, you could get them fairly. So, so, this is a good time now. Now, PS4, the Pro. That was the wrong time. What? Their stats. So they're going more RPG element in this game. Just like everything is NBA. RPG element now. Oh it's my like, god. Even fucking NBA had that RPG element to it. How the fuck is he gonna kill these two? We'll pass for now. He's gonna have to wait for it. Be patient. What is he saw? Did they see him? Guide me, Senu. That is very interesting. So, it's, so is this supposed to be like the beginning of everything? It said origin, so I would assume as such. Yeah, so is this like uh, pretty much the start of the order? The assassins? I would think so. That'd be interesting, right? I mean, ancient Egypt is also where magic and sleight of hand for stealing was kind of invented. So, thinking about this being where it would start, start yeah. it makes sense. And then, because because, because they, uh, the Templars in them, right, are all part of the World Order in this case, right? Yeah. They're behind everything, you know? You will die. So, so, we get to see how the Templars first started, you know? Whoa, there's dodging now? It sure looks like it. Was there dodging in the last game? I don't know. I, I haven't really played the last game a lot, so... He's strafing and sidestepping. That's cool. Dude, gameplay's improved. Oh, fuck! What does that remind me of? Finally. Did he just curve the arrow? What? He directed the arrow. Still not enough though. It's okay. It's cool looking, but I, I have. I guess I have to actually see if the game is really that good. We'll see how, how it goes. I'm still not a big Assassin's Creed fan. All. That's just the thing. Today, communities of gamers not only play together, they create together and watch together. A whole new genre of games has emerged designed for both the player and the community. And with Mixer, we're innovating new features to make these experiences that's that live, even better. That's that new gaming streaming service that they special. have for Xbox. Of all the games okay. in this genre. Yeah. Is that the one that's one supposed to be lagless or whatever? Yeah, it's supposed to be like Twitch. The, the one and that I goes against Twitch in terms many of, of Xbox. Okay. Okay. Xbox. Okay, I but, see where you're going. But I mean, it's, uh, it's exclusively for Xbox, I think. Uh, that is kind of lame, though. Yeah, it is. I, 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 don't, I don't know what they're trying to do with that. With I mean, having a streaming community. service that's Please only for one console seems kind of niche. Yeah, it's a douchey thing to do. 
well, this is Microsoft we're talking about here. The guys who were douchey enough to come out with the Zune and say it was so good because it had an <laughs> FM to it. Good afternoon, everyone. <laughs> It's fucking Apple's iPod, which still won. Yeah, it's like, I don't even like Apple, but the iPod was, was good, glorious. Cool. It was one of the best Our team's MP3 focus players is to bring the most It worked well. Experience ever to console Battle to wow, it's coming to Xbox. Across all Xbox One devices. It's coming to Xbox. Our development is truly community-driven, and we owe much of our success to everyone who's given us feedback over the past year. With over 3 million PC players to date, we can't wait to bring Player Unknown's Battlegrounds exclusively to Xbox One later this year with an update for Xbox One X enhancements shipping with the final version. That's pretty cool. See you on the Battlegrounds, everyone. So that's cool. Um, I don't know if you can cross-play, though. That'd be even cooler to play with Xbox players. Well, it says, it says console exclusive, so th this makes me think that it may be a separate version. Branch. Yeah. Yeah. That kind of that kills it for me a little bit. That kind of kills it. But it's gonna be in 4K. This is really cool. It makes you want a 4K TV, and now you can afford one now. There are plenty of people that can probably afford one now, even a 55 inch. Yeah, definitely. I mean, lower branded ones, but well, of course. Yeah. And next year we might have more TVs that are cheaper with HDR. Next probably year. yeah so probably this looks like daisy on fucking speed yeah uh, this is really popular on pc right now yeah all my friends are fucking talking about it i just don't have the money to get it right now how much is it right now i don't even know i'd have to check it out oh it's, on speed, it's like 30 though. right Let it could check. be like 30 bucks oh what just oh, happened no. oh okay. i was about to say fuck you buffering for a yeah, i know I'm like wow don't do that <laughs> don't do that to me right now stupid internet we have we're playing games, games with, with my heart, heart. <laughs> i was doing that yesterday yo uh but we have the fastest internet possible and we're so if this we has get... gotta suck for people on fucking century link right now yeah no offense if you have CenturyLink. Some areas just have that. Yeah, 10, 10 megs is not enough, guys. Never is enough. <laughs> oh, shit. How did you not blast them away? <laughs> you saw them coming for maybe a good it was, two seconds. Maybe it's meant for the video. Maybe. <laughs> <laughs> a frying pan just boof. <laughs> That's awesome. It's like, boom! Exclusive. Ooh, another exclusive, dude. Dude, everything's an exclusive right now. So they did say there's 22 games. Yeah. So, this so is we're gonna be looking at 22 exclusive trailers. But it's cool, though. Xbox actually is trying to fix their problem. They didn't have enough exclusives at launch. PlayStation has more than them. Yeah, PUBG is 30 bucks right now, by the way. Okay, so it is. I wish it was on sale. Metro's on sale. I guarantee, I bet Dude, you. Dude, Metro's on sale for five bucks. Yeah, there's an E3 sale going on right now. I might have to pick that up. So, I'm going to I'm going to go on the uh, on the limb right here, and say that every most of their games, most of the exclusives, will be indie games. Most of them. I'm thinking so. Because how the hell do they get 22 AAA titles? That's not possible. What if they announce a new Battleborn? <laughs> it's free to play now. Free to play. The the guy was saying that it's it's free, but not really. So Exclusive. I don't know. Oh wow! What the they hell changed some things. Apparently, some of the stuff is pay pay gated. Uh... I think. Oh, is the state of decay? This is state of decay. I think the newest one that's coming out. State of decay sounds like a thrash metal band. <laughs> no, it's a zombie game, but yeah, it's the dust. It's a zombie game where you work together in co-op. So it's so. DayZ. <laughs> um, it's much more eccentric to, uh, I don't know, so maybe, yeah. I, I don't know how to describe it. It's it's a different gameplay style, though. And the ones you okay. Love. But a lot of people like the original. Protectors so. Can't even save themselves. Yup, I think this is State of Decay. Windows 10 exclusive as well. Okay, that's cool. Okay. So now we know when they're saying that, okay. 4K, 4K and HDR. 
Okay, so now we know if it says just Xbox One console exclusive, then it's just it's an exclusive. Probably not going to be cross platform because it's not going to be released. For right, now. understood. At least for now. Dude, they might do it. I want to see what Nintendo has to say in in their conference about the new Pokemon Ultra Sun and Moon. I want to get those. But you do need a Switch for those. That's what they're no, saying. No, no, it's 3DS. When they put it up for Switch, that was a clerical error. It's meant only for the 3DS. Or, or the 3DS family. We'll see, though. We no, no, no. They said explicitly it is only going to be on handhelds. It will not be on the Switch. But Pokemon Stars, but Switch that may is, still be. But Switch is a handheld, too. No, but they were saying that it will not be coming to the Switch. They removed it from the site and said that was a clerical error. It is not coming to the Switch. That doesn't make sense, though, because the Switch is a handheld, too. You know you can take out the Switch. I, I, it, I'm it, completely like well aware. I'm completely well aware. I think that they're talking more about the whole two-screen thing. Mm. That it makes more sense on that. How will you build it? Whereas with the Switch screen... Even if you did split screen, it wouldn't translate properly. I would really want to get a Switch. I really want it now. To I really could care less. No, I because they started uh, introducing some new things like retro gaming. And it's cool. it's the best retro gaming uh, system now. It's like, here's my thing. It's like, I have a Wii. I have two games for it. I have a 3DS. I have like four games for it. I look at my PS3. I have a catalog of games. Xbox. If I had the money, I'd have a catalog of games. PC. Catalog of games. Nintendo just isn't so much for me, personally. I mean, like, if I had Mario Party for when friends are over, but no one comes over. One game that I do want, definitely, that makes me want to switch is definitely, uh... Is definitely, um... Zelda. The new Zelda. That's supposed to be Breath one of the, the wild. Yes, yeah, it's supposed to be a masterpiece. It's supposed to be a master masterpiece. Yeah, but it's like honestly, I can't justify buying a console for a couple games. I can't for that game alone. It's that like, game is my Wii. I got for free. For I heard. Free I heard that game is already good enough for as a console seller itself. Well, yeah, but it's like I can't justify paying that much. Right. Oh shit! That guy's dead. Yeah, it is State of Decay too. Play anywhere title. Okay. You can play it on Xbox One and on on Windows 10. So you can transfer and it can, over and play and, it on either one. Yeah, and also you can play it in the same servers. How will That's you cool. This, this is that is really cool. Carry on. That is fucking cool. Boss. So you can play with your friends. Yeah. At co-op. That's what it looks like. That is so fucking cool. It makes me want State of Decay now. I really think... Here's my thing, though. I really this think Destiny is going to be the ultimate people will play it for a long time kind of game. Because these these kind of games... Well, I it's an MMO, so of course. It's designed to be played for a long yeah, time. Yeah, while these games are like... Yeah, they have co-op. Like, say... um. Ghost Recon's Wild Wildlands. Yeah, that's a game that is so it's really good, but you can beat it with your friends pretty quickly. Yeah, of course. So there's not a lot of content for that. So that's why it what it's not not a lot of people play it as much. But it's still Exclusive. a good game, you know. Of course. Well, this Destiny is gonna be so cool. It's gonna be people are gonna play it for a long time. So State of Decay is cool. I don't think I'm gonna be like super in. in into it though that's my opinion hey dude it's brandon yuri from panic at the disco no, no. console exclusive that really does look like brandon yuri in a fucking video game though Two players remaining. What the fuck? One player remaining. Stealth. I want to play from the wounded warrior. She was caught in a trap. 
the Chiefs' superior tactics to get herself out of there. She's going to take the win. Let's what is this, Hunger the Games, the fucking video game? What the Carol. fuck There's is this? <gasps> left in this particular match. Whoa, it's like a MOBA. But that tree is going to give him direct information. That red outline, there's a mortal unicorn, and he's letting in about 100 meters away now. Dude, this is like a MOBA. That's what it looks like. It looks like, um, remember, uh, what's that game? Dude. Is he gonna walk in through the front door or what? What's that game that I was playing that, uh, that's third person kind of MOBA like? Battleborn? No, no, the other one. The one I played on Xbox, remember that one day? Uh, Defenders? No, uh, fuck. Paragon? No. Uh, gigantic. Oh, gigantic. That's right. It looks like it, huh? It does. Whoa! It's a MOBA. It is the, the Darwin, Darwin Project. Project. Okay, so the strongest survive type. Of thing. So it's their own. It's it's a console exclusive MOBA.